tutorial on the Android TV box. For the purpose of this tutorial I'm using the CS918 model that you can get on our site monstergadgets.com. Okay, so when you receive your model you will connect it up to your TV via the HDMI cable that is provided. And the first thing you want to do is, is go into your settings here, turn on the Wi-Fi, find which your supplier is, in my case here it's Aircom, click on that and you put in your um, Wi-Fi code. Okay. So once all that is done, you're obviously going to watch some, want to watch some TV, movies, sport. You click on this icon here, which is the XPMC icon. On some users, you might have a SPMC icon. So we'll just click on that there now. Okay. So once that is opened, you will be having this screen here. So you will see your family, movies, Sky movies, TV shows, live sport, and UK Live TV. Now we're going to go into each section, so let's start off with the family. So if you want to watch a Disney movie, just click on the Disney collection here. Leave that load up. And for example, you want to watch Cars 2. Click on the movie. I already played this area on, so we'll just start it from the beginning. And there you go, Cars 2 starts to play. And just to prove it's Cars 2, we'll just skip it forward a little. Yeah. Let's come out of that. Okay, we can also go into tap, Top Cartoon, which is basically movies from other providers. So, for example, we want to watch, oh, I don't know, let's go into Son of Batman. Again, just click on a movie you wish to view, and Son of Batman begins to play. And as you can see, there's a wide variety of movies for all the family they can watch here. Now, the next one you want to go into here is movies. So, to watch the latest movies, just click on movies. Okay, let's have a look at the most popular movies that's out at the moment. Click on that. And just say you want to watch Gone Girl. Click on Gone Girl. So you'll see this message popping up saying opening stream. What's basically happening here, folks, is that it's looking for the best link to play. So this might take a couple of seconds. So just bear with it. And this obviously also depends on uh, your broadband speed and so on. The broadband speed where I am at the moment is 7 megabytes. So obviously the faster broadband you have, the faster the, the movie will load for you. And finally, there you go, Gone Girl has come on. And again, we can just skip ahead to show that this is Gone Girl. And as you can see just here, it's playing in a 720p. So, come out of that. Okay, go back out of here. Now you can also search by genre, so you know choose family or action, choose by languages, box office by year, what people are watching. Uh, you can also just go down to the search function here, and if you wanted to watch, I don't know, we'll just type in tour as an example. Just say you want to watch a tour movie, type in tour, click on done. So all the tour movies load up here. So we want to watch the latest one, Tour, The Dark World. So click on that, and again, you're going to see the opening stream as it looks for the best link. So 
So just give it a couple of moments. Let's just start to play, and there we go. Tour to that world. Okay, for the next part, you're going to go into the Sky Movies. Now, this folks isn't um, the Sky Movie channels as such, but this is more of an on-demand service. So it's telling you what is on the Sky Movie channels. For example, you see here Sky Premiere showing Healing, Sky Disney showing the Fox and the Hound, Sky Family, Daddy Daycare, Sky Action, The Karate Kid, so on. So basically, uh, what you want to do here is if you want to watch, oh, I don't say Drive Hard, which is on Sky Premiere Plus One, you just click on the channel and the movie you wish to view. And what's going to happen here, once this is opening the streams, it will start the movie from the beginning. So, you know, if Drive Hard, for example, is already 30 minutes through, it's going to start from the very start. So you, you don't have to worry about when the movie starts and finishes, really. Again, it's just searching for the links. And there we go, that's the uh, drive hard. And again, I can put it forward a little bit. There we go. Next on the list is TV shows, which is uh, probably my favorite list. So if you want to watch the latest TV shows, just click on TV shows. And we, you again, like the movies, you can just click on search and you can type in which TV show you wish to view, you can use people search, etc. I'm just going to go into the most popular TV shows right now. So you see here we've Game of Thrones, Asian Carter, all the way down. So just for example you want to watch Arrow, click on Arrow, and you'll see Season 1, Season 2 and Season 3 load up. So if you're in Season 2, click on that. And if you want to watch, oh, I don't know, say episode 7, we'll go with that. Again, you'll see the opening stream icon come up. So again, just bear with it. It does take, you know, a minute or so to open up. But once it opens up, you won't have to worry about buffering or anything like that because it, it will play straight off. There you go. So that's Arrow. So that's your TV shows. Next one is your live sport. So here's all, where all your sporting channels are. So for example, uh, be in sports, which we all know isn't part of cable providers in the UK or Ireland. If you want to wish that, just uh, if you want to view that, sorry, just click on be in sports. They all load up here. So you want to watch be in sport one. Click on that, and there we go. Be in sport one. Quite similarly, if you wish to view some US sports channels, click on USA Sports. Oh, one moment, sorry. Just go back into that. Oh, 
Oh yes, it was updated, that's why the link went dead last time. So, USA Sports. Click on that. And for example, you want to watch the NBC Sports Network, which shows the Saturday 3pm games in the Premiership. Just click on that. And there we go, as you can see, NBC Sports. Next, if you wish to view your UK sports, so click on UK sports, for example, Sky Sports 1. There we go. Your Sky Sports 1 loads up. Same with all the other channels here Sky Sports News, BT Sports 1, Your Sport, Actor Races, Box Nation. Uh, MUTV, they're all in there. Next is your UK Live TV. This is for your free to view channels. So you just click on that. And for example, if you wanted to watch, no, we go up to BBC One, click on the channel you wish to view. And there we go, BBC One starts to play. So that is basically it folks. You have your UK Live TV, your Live Sport, your TV shows, your Sky Movies, your movies, and of course your family stuff. Now, um, if you do want some adult shows added in the checkout process, just leave me a quick note and I can add that as well for you. So, so I hope you found this... Uh, tutorial some bit helpful and remember visit monstergadgets.com and you can use code follow5 to get five pound off any device okay thank you folks